Welcome to Colorado Bigfoot. Really quickly, there's a couple recent clips. Then I go into, I think, a world record amount of stills. Then more video at the end. And I cut it in between during the music, unfortunately. Over and out. I can see the face now from here. So this is the one spot. I know there's many, but this is the one that I've really gotten uh, to know here in the last month or two. Anyway, I'm just on the way to the post office. This isn't a video. This is, there's no, I don't need pictures for this. This is, but because of that, I'm able to do that. You know what I mean? Like, what if, what if, you know, one day because I just did this, the, the secrets of the world unfold. There's that one that just hangs there. Because you can see the doorway. Look, there's something there. Another thing balanced underneath it. That's theirs. Can you see it? They're right in there. And there's the spot I did the before and after. He was he was standing. I got his entire body with an X on his chest and a tree. And the tree is missing. He used to be right there. Now the tree used to be one of those right there. It's not, I looked over, there's the face. I looked over uh, a, a couple times to make sure that that tree, I wasn't making a mistake and no, it's definitely, there was that same type of tree was right there. At least it appeared to be a tree. And he was touching it and next, and he had an X on his, on his chest that was touching that tree. I came back and the tree is two or three weeks after that and the, and the tree was gone and he was gone, of course. And that's pretty cool. I could do one thousand. I could do a thousand before and afters. Why bother? No one watches. <laughs> Welcome to Colorado Bigfoot. This is about one percent of our still pictures, uh, which I believe will be the most ever shown. Not only will it be the most, it'll be the most times about fifty or a hundred. Uh, and I could duplicate this. I could add another ten thousand pictures to this. We have the most, we have not only the best, by such a long shot team, we have the most evidence and that we're the furthest along in this subject of anybody in the world. And no one can contest it. We are, we have shown the way and you can see thousands of people doing exactly what we show. It's kind of funny to see that they, they have, some of them have to go out on their own and they'll never acknowledge how they learned it. It's pretty sad that, you know, that you're like that. Um, we should all be united as a, as a people. If you had any idea what this earth really was and who you really were, you, you would you, <laughs> we would be the most famous people in the world. Um, everything you know, everything about this earth that you know is a lie. Everything you've been taught and told is a lie. And we will show you this all over time. Over now. From up here the world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me we meant to be In the great outdoors Forever free
I just want to take this one, just one quick minute here to thank everyone on Patreon. You guys, without you, there would be nothing. No one would ever know anything. So t- take a huge bow or credit for that because <laughs> it's, it can't be done without you. And I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart, especially the other people that actually people that are on Patreon as well and do all the work with pictures and, and, and diagnosing videos like Gail. Thank you so much for all the time you spend to help people understand and to help see these creatures better and understand how we've been tricked our whole lives. Terry, uh, people like Rita on super chat that helped me and Lisa, L E S A Lisa and, um, Michelle on project X and Cassandra, Michael B, you do an amazing job. It just the, the list, John Pappas, it just goes on and on and on. All the new people that have been on and are fully on board in an energy overload. I could just I could run down all the names. These names are in my head. There's there's many of you. Don't I don't want um don't be insulted if I don't say your name because there's lots of you that are right up top with us. I just can't list all the names right the second. Um but I just wanted to thank all of you guys. Carlos, thank you so much. Carlos is just the best at he's he's always there for me he helps me with some of the best pictures he helps me um financially sometimes i mean he's just been an amazing friend so carlos i love you thank you so much just everybody that's involved in this it's um it's an amazing thing in fact i wake up some mornings just not even believing it like how is it possible that we have the best team and all these amazing people and I'm just so very thankful. So thank you. What do you guys want? Rock and roll? I'm trying to figure out what song to put in. Also, you might see a duplicate or two. The way I have to put these in, it's almost impossible to tell. I mean, I'm pretty close. So if you do see a picture twice, I apologize. You might see a couple that I did on purpose that are different shots. So you might see the same shot kind of like this, you know, where it's, you know, someone colored it. Jeffrey, thank you on Patreon did that. Jeffrey's Jeffrey is another guy on Patreon who does an amazing, I, I, Jeffrey disappears occasionally. Like he's always on Patreon, but like he'll disappear. Then all of a sudden he shows up with like a link to the best video, to the best pictures ever like that he does for me. So Jeffrey, you're, you're amazing. Thank you. There's so many people that I just want to thank that helped me do this. And uh, it's, it's an amazing thing to to be a part of and you guys we're we are the best and we're we're without us th- this subject goes nowhere and if you don't believe that it's that, you know it's up to you. you you can believe whatever you want but just sit back and watch i mean all the evidence is there is that an ego no it's just a fact um it's it's a confidence issue i have i'm that confident because you have no idea where i've been and what i've done and what i really know and all you got to do is stick around over and out
does it affect them with tech? They did this, so I was explaining to her. So this is just for the people that watch, that follow me consistently. In fact, if you don't follow me all the time, you're not going to understand half of what I tell you. Um, and if you're, you're missing out on the secrets of the earth by not doing it. So it's why you don't, it's, it's beyond me. You don't have to like me. <laughs> I'm giving, I'm explaining your, your entire existence to you <laughs> slowly. And, uh, you know, people are just, it, you'll always have dumb people. It's just part of life, I guess. I don't, I'm not sure. So let's do some timestamps just right here. I never forget so the one that I watched him put his head up through the top of the trees while I was going this way. It's all on video. I'm just curious. You guys, don't give me any blur to, on this one. Give me, you know, it's got to be a good timestamp. Will he be just standing there at 8 o'clock in the morning? when it's 9 degrees. It's actually just went up to 10. It's 10 up here. I thought it was very nice of me. That's why I haven't gone back here because she kind of like claimed this pyramid, this lady that lives here. I forget her name. I don't think she completely got it, but she got it enough when I was here. Uh, this is a great place to sit over that. that the house is there. I'm stalking them. Of course, the only good place to zoom, there's a house looking right at me. Which isn't the end of the world, but look at this guy. Is this guy insane? What is that guy doing? He's on a mountain bike. <laughs> in the shade at, in nine degrees. I guess I'm, I'm not kidding. Like, I don't know how he's doing that. The guy was like 70. Who would be, who would be in this darkness right now? And on a mountain bike. So they came right down, right down. Every you see, every, all the trees have these, these certain breaks on them, and they came right to me right here. This is a great time. Remember, it's not what you think. Like, it is what some of you think. It's not what most of you think. It's you, you got to use your imagination a little bit on how they can move and how they can just be there and like you know even if they're not near here like he can just they can come down near me and visit me and okay there's the one spot right there it's right there so here's the spot where it's it's a good if we're running at timestamps it'd be right here it's a whole spot i've been to it it's a seat everything and i wouldn't expect to see him there right now even if they're on a rotation you know we always think that's his seat well it might be 200 different being seats. You got an X out front. Let's see that. Look, it's an upside down trident X. Remember, do, do, scale is meaningless, okay? Don't let your brain dictate scale. Like, you know what I mean? Like, like don't let scale dictate, you know, what you think of it. <laughs> That's why, you know, I've been, and I've always practiced that. People are like, Mark, I know this isn't what you have. I know it's not as good as you. I know, I'm like, what are you talking about? In, in my brain, it, it is. It's not a competition of who could find the coolest structure. Yeah, I mean, we want we want that in a way. Like you know, if you if you find you found like Mark, I found the best structure in the whole world today. Like, of course, I want to see that. You know what I mean? But it's it's not like a competition. You know, I've, I, you wouldn't believe how many people I've told like that's the best structure I've ever seen in my life. You can probably comment if I said that to you because I, I'm not lying. It's. I, I, at that moment, truly believe that. Because <laughs> everything's the best to me. They're all amazing to me. I don't care what scale it's on, what looks cool. Now, it is it is a little different when you're, you know, you're standing there and you get to stand on something. Like, in these types of places, I have to show you, like, okay, they did this bend, they did this. But when I can, when I walk you into a real Bigfoot world in the forest, deep in the forest, you, that there's nothing, there's no feeling quite like that. <laughs> like, because you don't nothing. No one has to explain anything to you. you. You know where you're standing is not of. It's not normal. You know. It's and then I can do it again and again and again. And then no one else can repeat that. You know. So you'll. I mean, you know what I mean. Like, like in other words, if I blow your mind and then you go to try to do it again, you won't be able to. You'll need me again. There's only certain people that become really good at it. And we're talking about repetition. You know, where you'll you'll see the same people never. Stop. They'll always have an endless amount of, of uh, new stuff. 
even if they're not doing it, they're just doing it for themselves. Like Dutchie, right Dutchie? It's a nickname, but... I think that's, see how it's like weird looking? I think it's the cold. It's so cold. Like you know how you get to see through heat? Well, now you're seeing through real cold, but it is gorgeous up there. The way that thing hits the sun, there is no accident on this place. Like that, that they exist here because of how beautiful it is. Snow, pretty much the whole winter stays melted right there. That whole mountain is melted. So that's it. That's that's a good. Uh, I'm not, I haven't seen anything. Usually, I see something happening, whether I mention it or not. I'm not seeing. It doesn't mean anything, but I need something today. I'm, I'm looking at nine degrees. You know, what I mean, I want to see what's happening. Actually, it's uh, it's twelve now. These people are very protective of this road, the, the, na the neighbors, but it's it's legal. It's not, they, they want they want to, they think it's like, it should be illegal. And it's, uh, it's actually legal to be here. I, I think it's too chilly. <laughs> I really do, like, I think, you know, like, if they need to be outside, like, I'm sure there's some out, you know, but um, I think most of them aren't, just like you're not, and not when it's nine degrees. Like, if, if you have a choice at nine to be inside or to be outside, depending on where you live and what your situation is, you're probably going to choose the fireplace. Let's be honest. I mean, it is just not me because I don't, I don't want to go home to a trailer. <laughs> I really don't want to go home to a trailer right now. And I'm, I'm thrilled, don't get me wrong, with having the new space, but I still live in a trailer. Remember that. Here we go. I know people, you know, because people do, people have what I have, and but they use it on the weekend, and there's nothing more exciting than going camping in a fifth wheel for the weekend. Whoa. You know what I mean? That's That's a blast. You gotta wait till you're three years, four years into it, and then you start. <laughs> it starts to get you to it. It actually, it's okay. I think what it is, it's the it's the seasonal, it's the cold, penetrating cold that no trailer in the world can keep out. I mean, well, I shouldn't say that, but your average, even I'm in all season. My trailer, my water doesn't freeze or anything, and it still comes through. You know, you're just in. It's just a cold thing. It's a it's a constant camping trip. My X is still there. Look at that X, you guys. If it, if it was just solely standing there, you'd be blown away. Like if there was no tree behind it to drown it, you would see how beautiful that X is with the third right there. They did that, and then right next to it's the triangle. Look, it's without fail, their language. I just can't figure out what, what they're marking. See, I think it's all through here. We just put the road there, you know what I mean? So this, it's everything in here. We, we You wouldn't believe what we have. Some of you will because you found them, but what the timestamps that we were getting in there are simply incredible. Hey, and what about this guy? <laughs> like, I, all of a sudden, this guy just comes out of here at nine degrees on a mountain bike, and he's like 70, to, 70 years old. We'll see if we catch up to him. I mean, I don't know how, how he would do that. Because, you know, unless you're, I guess if you're pedaling uphill, but going, like, if you have no, if you haven't worked up a sweat, like, or some heat, and you're on a bicycle at nine degrees going down a hill, it is, it's even colder now. Because you got the wind chill. Amazing. Let's just do a quick zoom here. This isn't where I want to go down a little bit. I am repeating, I've been here, I don't know, so this is like my third time in the last month or two. It's early in the morning. You can see how the sun, let me show you something. Look how the sun hits over there. It's incredible, look where I am. Complete darkness. It's always sunny there. It's always sunny in Colorado. I'm kidding, what was I thinking? Is it Philadelphia or something? I never saw that show, but. Let me just take a quick, these aren't the spots. See if I knew exactly the spot there, I could do it, but I can go to the before and after spot. That was amazing, did you guys see the before and afters? How cool was that? T 
temperature so far, I think does have some bearing, but it's not, you know, they just, it's like us, they just work around it. I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm not, let's put it this way, I'm not convinced that they are exactly us. But here's the thing, there's so many different ones of them, how could they all be the same too? The only way to make everybody that's different the same, how do we do that? Technology. <laughs> you can do anything with technology.